Yeah, so emissions have levelled out, but it's too early to say whether that's a, a peak in global emissions. So first of all, we need to see emissions going down. So we'll have to uh, wait some years to see if that happens. And then after that, we would need several years, maybe even a decade, to be confident that it was actually a, a peak. And you know, there's a couple of good examples. EU emissions have been going down for basically two decades, so we can comfortably say it's peaked. Uh, US emissions have been going down for about a decade, but even then it's a little bit early to say with confidence it's a peak. Maybe the Trump presidency would lead to an increase in emissions. And there's a very nice example in the US of vehicle miles. So over the last years there's been these studies coming out saying the vehicle miles travelled in the US has peaked and have trended downwards and people have come out with explanations about millennials and their behaviour and this is a big change. And then all of a sudden vehicle miles have increased again um, on the back of low oil prices. So you have to be very cautious in proclaiming a peak and you need lots of data over a long period of time to be confident that something's peaked.